So everybody knows Austria for its most famous exports, its Arni. But there are other machines from Austria. In fact, just a short drive from his home up the river, we at Zeman are hard at work producing the best assembly and welding machines in the world. I describe the job of a traditional iron worker with three Ds. It's dirty, it's difficult, and it's dangerous. But it's a vital job for the economic growth and for the future of our cities and industries. Thiemann machines, they make a cleaner, a more productive, and a safer space for those workers who build the future. This is why our good partner in America, Padding House, just ordered the Paddy Assembler, which is a fantastic, flexible, and versatile single rail compact machine. We just decided to film the making of documentary from the production in Austria until delivery in Illinois. You will get an unprecedented look of all the production process. You will meet the key team members and understand why the partnership with Padding House is stronger than steel. So uh, welcome to the Thiemann head office in Vienna here. My name is uh, Andreas Hofer and I'm the CEO of Thiemann Machinery Building Company. And here my associate is uh, Andy Gango. He is the area sales manager for North America, mainly involved in the good cooperation with Padding House. Let me talk a little bit about the uh, Thiemann company. We are a fully integrated company. We are a structural steel fabricator as all of our machinery clients as well. We started steel fabrication almost 60 years ago. My father-in-law, Mr. Zeman, started this business. And in the 80s, we came up with uh, the first machines, not really robotic cells, but uh, roll forming machines. And then uh, based on the thin beam uh, technology, we, uh, we just built the first robotic assembly and welding line in the 80s. It was like 85, I believe. Eric, how are you today? Good, Anton. How are you? Excellent. I'd shake your hand, but you know. <laughs> Dude, there we go. Why did Penning House order now the third Petty Assembly? Yeah, well, if you've seen the videos that we've released, and I know obviously you have, the testimonies on the machines that we have sold are enough for us to want to buy another one. One of them, which I saw for the first time in Brazil, then I saw many times with our customers in uh, Germany, in Austria, mm -hmm. Switzerland, and then and was a Siemens robotic line that do over 10 years. Because Anton, many times he told me, why should I invent something what is already available to such a beautiful extent on the market? Why should I do that uh, by myself? Let's just bring the good players together. And this was the reason, actually, in 2010, when we shook hands. When Andreas and I decided, hey, it's time to build the product for the American market and for petting house. That's how we came together. We have lots of super happy customers you can see on YouTube, and then, and, and, and it's a stunning product and a great partnership. It really solved uh, the request on the market to uh, to achieve and build a machine ready for small and medium-sized fabricators. Yeah, it also helps the skilled labor that you already have move on to other processes down the line and maybe help in other ways while this takes care of um, the fitting. Side loading is possible. We had the crazy idea to open the welding tower and let's just travel uh, the big uh, manipulation robot underneath the tunnel. You put the, the, the beam in there, you put the blades on the parts table and the machine is taking care of the rest. Yeah. It's accurate, it's efficient, um, it increases throughput throughout shops. Those uh, those things that it that it helps out kind of ripple throughout the entire shop and increase the entire help the entire process of the shop. We, we know that two thirds of all steel fabricators in the next five to seven will have one of those systems. It's um, hard to motivate young people to go in this line of business, right? 
the average uh, welder is 55 years old. So, and the young generation is just not there in that amount what is required for the future. And so, therefore, there is automation required. And I think uh, with our product, um, we have definitely the right solution for the structural steel industry. Together, we uh, change the industry by protecting these people, be more efficient, solve the bottleneck of available workers, welders, fitters. We all know that these guys are hard to get on the market. A lot of uh, money to be paid, the salary is rising, and honestly under very hard working conditions. Come with me if you want to succeed.